What's up friends, I'm Jimmy Chang. Today I'm going to be unboxing the Kush High. It's a new foot pad by The Float Life. Okay, right off the bat, you can see that it has nice artwork here on the cover. Let's see what's in here. You can see here it's made in California. This is 100% American made. New logo for that. Another Kush sticker. What I do love about the Float Life products is they come with the hardware necessary to install. Got a couple extra stickers. Float Life grip tape. Very nice grip tape in my opinion. There it is. The high. And so it's made of that same flexible urethane. I think they call it ADA durometer or durameter urethane. It's like a soft skateboard wheel material. It's more forgiving under the foot. And then it's got that higher tail. Let's check out some of the specifications and how it compares to some of the other foot pads out there. Some of the other foot pads that I use. So first off, let's just compare it to the stock. And if I just put them next to each other, you can see the difference in the shape compared to the, this is the Kush original, made of that same flexible material. So this is the Kush, got it in red and in black. And there you can see the height difference between the two. This is the Cobra pad. And you can see how aggressive of a tail it has. And so you can see the Kush isn't quite as aggressive of a tail, but comes close. So let's put all three together there. We have Kush on the top, Cobra in the middle, and Kush High on the bottom. Heck, why don't we just make a sandwich out of it? There we go. We have Kush on the top, original after that. We've got the Cobra pad, and then we have the Kush High. So this is the stock foot pad coming in at 330 grams. This is the Kush Original with a little bit of debris and some leaves on it. Kush Original coming at 626 grams. This is the Cobra. And the Cobra is coming in at 682 grams. And then this is the Kush High coming in at 766 grams. Most people are going to be wondering about the differences between the Kush High and the Cobra. Here I have the Cobra on my left. This is the Kush. So the Kush is more flexible. The Cobra is more rigid. The Kush weighs just a little bit more than the Cobra. Just under an inch and a half. Whereas on the Kush High, we're about an inch and a quarter. The Cobra tail is a little bit higher by about a quarter inch. But then the thing that really interested me was the concavity. The beauty of these concave pads is being able to rest your foot in this pocket that is created. Concavity wise, the Kush High is more concave, has a deeper pocket than the Cobra. The Cobra has a more subtle concavity and it's more about the, that tail at the end. So the main thing with that Kush High, it's sort of to uh, 
cater to the folks that think that, that they prefer a deeper, heavier concave and not really locked in foot. But our main goal with it was to like really clean up the lines and shape it on the interior to the point where the outside edges, like the toe and the heel and the kicktail didn't have to be super giant. So we tried to keep, keep the uh, lines as clean as possible on it, make it sort of look like it's a part of your board, you know, instead of being, a, being an aftermarket add-on, you know? So uh, that's the main thing, but other than that, it's same old Kush material, same old Kush shaper, same old, same old, and it's definitely a trail shredder for sure. The original Kush foot pad was one of my favorites, and I am pretty sure that this is going to be pretty awesome. Already riding it, it feels nice and soft, just like its predecessor, but not so soft that I lose performance. On their website, they called this Kush High the Goldilocks of foot pads. It's not too soft, it's just soft enough. It's not too firm, it's just firm enough. I do love the deeper concavity so that my foot can feel more locked in. I think this is going to be awesome. And as I get more experience, I will be giving a full review in the future. Let me know what your favorite foot pad is down in the comments, and I'll catch you in the next one.